What's going on guys? Mellow Link here, what is cracking? Been a while since I made a video. Um, I was supposed to do this with the other trailers for Jin and Kazuya, and they were amazing, so I really wish I did uh, a live watch with those, but uh, you know, we move on here. Oh, and Nina as well, forgot about her, who was actually pretty good. Um, so I decided to do a live watch with Paul's trailer. Have not seen this, don't know what's gonna be in it. Um, I'm sure he's gonna be crazy since it is Paul. But, uh, you know, I guess we'll wait and see. And uh, yeah, can't wait to see what's, uh, what's in the trailer. Please tell me they're gonna get rid of the announcer though. I cannot, I just can't do this announcer. Oh, he's, he's, the graphics are so good. I'll come back to it. We'll watch it. What? Alright, alright. Right, we'll watch it. Watch it probably. But just the way that was executed. Why? What the? Oh, a new stage! Oh my god! Bro! Oh! <laughs> Oh, that is sick. Strongest in the universe. Wait, what is sleeves ripped? Alright, all right, all right. now we can finally go back and break it down. That, those graphics there, amazing man. Like, look at the detail in his face, the creases, the expression. Just everything about it. Why does he always have a rope? I just, I never understood that. That, that looks good, graphically, but that does not look like Paul. Does a wheelie. Alright, so this move here is his up forward two, but they've made it look less ridiculous. It was like a donkey punch before, and he goes way too high, and like it was not really viable unless you've got the opponent to not press anything and you have a bit of time to do something. But uh, other than that, it's uh, yeah, you can't really use it in match that that often. So they've reduced the frames here. It looks a lot better as well, graphically. Um, oh, so that's his back. Oh, so they've nerfed back three now. So back three. Oh, so that must be... Must be plus four-ish. And then he's done back three, the launcher. Which doesn't launch anymore. It just does like a... I don't even know what to call that. Leg flip extension. And you can probably get it. Yeah, Death Fist after it. So, nice. Look at that. Look at the animation for Law though, where he got hit by while standing four. Like, that's huge. Is that just for spark moves that are while rising or or any spark moves? Is that a different Death Fist? I swear it looks different to the other one. Is it different? Is 
so the blue sparks oh maybe it's a blue spark death fist because it sort of had those the animation for that what is that kick tracking move so he's got a mid kick tracking move safe and then his classic armor move still there this is the weirdest string I've ever seen while standing one two into a barge while standing mix up interesting is that for like forward forward two two cancels or I don't know and then the new stage. Yes, he's still got up back two. Heat. So forward one plus two is his heat smash or whatever it's called. Oh, so that must have been the while standing punches must have gone into a stance because he looks like he does the same shove here after three three two into stance. You know what I mean? Four, four, two, one. Death Fist is obviously heat. Demo Man is now that. This is interesting. I want to know what this is. So he does while standing. Law does while standing two, and it's launch punishable. So in response, he does that, which is like. You know, whatever input it is, into a an attack throw. I love attack throws. I feel like they should be a lot more in the game. Like they're, they're quick, they do a lot of damage, they're fun to watch. But that wasn't guaranteed. After he he blocked that back too, so it's a heat starter or something. And then you must get a mix up from that. It must be plus. Is there any like indication of? Now it looks like he recovers in time. Right? It looks like he's back to st Oh, maybe. Could be slightly plus. This is sick though. Back to one full charge is now a guard break. That is awesome. That is a huge addition that just makes the game a lot more interesting. You know what I mean? Balcony break. Up back to... Oh, wait. So he's forward 2, 3, 1. He can now do it without the forward 2. And it tracks. Oh, yeah. There's that move again. Is he in while standing? Yeah, he is. So he's crouching there. While standing 1, 2, whatever it is. And then he goes into stance. Quarter circle back 2. Which now gets a follow up. That's huge. That's such a good move. But you just never got anything off it. Yep. Quarter circle back 3, 2, 1. Oh yes. That is so sick. I actually forgot this was there. Um, another attack throw. They're just cool ways to finish combos, you know what I mean, as well. It's not quarter circle forward one, is it? Because he's using his elbow. Oh, it's, it's, he's using his right hand, so it's two. And then, that's sick suplex. And he still has Kawara Goma, quarter circle back four. In the rage up. Looking pretty sick. He, see, he's still got like his. Yeah, he does rip his shirt. That's crazy. What the hell? Punches her, he rips his jacket. So he's still got a lot of his old stuff, but they have revamped it to make it way more interesting. The guard breaks, the attack throws, super exciting stuff. So. I've never heard that part of the song before. But yeah, he looks solid, as you can expect. Um, he's going to be a big damage dealer. Uh, you know, heavy mix-ups. He's got a new stance mix-up transition. Um, and we know he's just built for raw power there. So, 
you know, we know sort of what we're getting into if we pick him. So, um, yeah, that was my thoughts on, on Paul. Really excited to see um, whoever comes next. Um, but if I had to rate the trailer so far, Kazuya's would be the best. And then Jin. And then Paul. And then Nina. But that doesn't that's not to say I don't like Nina. Like, I'm actually interested in Nina. And I probably will pick her as well. Um, but yeah, let me know what you guys think of the trailer. And if you enjoyed it, take it easy for now, guys. Peace.